what's up you guys and welcome back to our channel what's up you guys and welcome back to currently build the generational wealth lifestyle i am one of your hosts the one the only and the flyers on today i am danielle bailey and of course god is the ultimate host he is our source he is also our provider over here um on currently building generational wealth lifestyle i hope that y'all are having an amazing day um so i want to say this first off i may not be as loud or you know as personality my personality <laughs> may be dulled down a little bit in this video it's because i'm recording this video at like two o'clock in the morning and i don't want to wake up my neighbors and stuff like that so i am really and truly within myself trying to be a little bit lower and not be so loud but i will say this that i am so proud right now of myself that i am really and truly tapping into my discipline side because truth be told i was like i'm not going to post a video because i did not record it earlier today but I was, um, I fell asleep early and so then I woke up at like one something to go ahead and shower even though I had fell asleep. And so while I was, while I was getting ready to shower, it was like, you need to make your video. And so I am tapping into the discipline, um, side of things. So if today's video may be a little bit aggressive, <laughs> um, know that it is coming from a place of like, I really and truly had to tap into my discipline side and like, I'm not accepting any excuses or anything thing like that from you guys neither okay so that's kind of like where we at um and today's topic really and truly i get a lot from when i tell because y'all know i work with therapists and stuff like that some of them one-on-one -on -one, and um a lot of people are often they often be like oh i can't do it and today's topic is about how to overcome your fear about um making social media content right now in today's society like y'all we you need to if you're not having a youtube channel if you you know youtube channel will be great but if you don't have a youtube channel you really and truly need a presence on social media so making videos for your facebook page for your business page um you you don't even have to be as personal as i am but making content that is helpful to people so that they can see you and stuff like that and you post it on your business page you can do that like and so that's what i want to talk about today a lot of, is your social media presence and i know that sometimes people they like i don't want to be so personal with um you know showing my family and stuff like that like there's you can't, you cannot show your family or you cannot show, you know, your, your real, um, your real life and you could just be professional on your actual business page, but whatever it is, you need to make content and stuff like that. So like, that's what today's video is. I want to talk about five tips to help you overcome your fears of getting on social media and making content. So if that's something that you're interested in, make sure you guys like share and subscribe to this YouTube channel. So y'all, I get this a lot. Like, especially when I was doing my, um, couch survivor practice, my pilot program, it was 10 people. And I was like, y'all, y'all got to start making, like we do a whole section in my couch to private practice program, we got a whole class about marketing. Okay. And everybody in there, except for one person, I think that she really went on ahead and got on Instagram and started um, making her content and stuff like that. Do you know, out of all those 10 people, not, um, she's the only one. So everybody else struggled with making videos and all this other kind of stuff. And so like, I want to talk to you guys about that today. Like, Social media is free, okay? It's free, and if you use it right, you can bring a lot of clients. Like, yo, if we look at our own selves, let's take ourselves out of therapist hat. If you was going to look for a doctor's or anything, if you was going to look, no, let's say you're going to look for a PCP, what are you going to do? You're going to Google the PCP, right? You're going to see, you're going to Google them, see if you can, if they have any work out there, you know, you're going to go and look for them. Or if you, even if you want to, you know, if you, if you want to eat, find somewhere to eat, you're going to look at the reviews and all of that. Like you're going to do your research. So people are going to do that for a therapist too. They're really going to do their research. So you need to put yourself in front of the camera so that you can show people, Hey, I know what I'm talking about. Hey, I do this. I am that girl. I am that therapist. And you need to come and see me. 
So, like, get yourself out there in front of the camera. Talk to people. And I know that a lot of people is like, oh, my God, I can't do lives. Well, don't do lives. Do pre-recorded videos. But do something. Okay? People need your content. People need you. Stop. Don't give me no excuse today because I'm going to say why. Okay? Um, so, five tips right here. Number one, coming at um, pre-recorded videos. Okay? Take your camera out, you know, um, record something, record you talking, whatever it is that you want to talk about for that day. Um, don't worry about, like, just don't be so, don't be so scripted, you know, like have a guideline. Like today I have a guideline right here, right? Y'all may be able to see it, y'all can't. But I have five talking points that I want to try to talk about so that I can stay on topic because I can wander off and the video can be forever. So Create you like a little quick guideline. Don't think that your videos have to be super long. Maybe make them like for a minute or two. And rich, really and truly, if you want to make like a little quick video, um, I would say make it a minute. And a minute is a lot of time to talk, y'all. Um, so like it doesn't have to be long. Introduce yourself. Introduce your practice. And, you know, like just pre-record all your videos if you can't do lives. Um, number two, be yourself. Be yourself on camera. Do not try to, y'all, look, I, I, I talk to y'all like this. I don't adjust my speech. I don't, um, this is me. So be yourself on camera. Don't think that you have to be like somebody else because somebody else sit prim proper. They talk proper and stuff like that. No, like don't. Be yourself because people are going to identify with you. They're going to be like, okay. Like I had one client say, yo, I looked at your YouTube videos and, um, I like you. And I, and, and because of how you talked on your YouTube videos, I feel like that you will be able to understand me and get me. Now, y'all, when the client told me that they had looked at my YouTube video, I said, Lord, you know, I'll be cutting up over there. Right? So what video did you watch? <laughs> okay. I was just like, what, what, what video did you watch? Okay, I was like, Lord, have mercy, Jesus. But, like, and, and, and when I said that, like, they laughed. They was like, I really identify with you. So, come across. Be yourself, man. Like, yo, I am not one of them therapists that is stuck up that I pronounce the word wrong sometime and I tell a child, like, I, 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 I. So, be yourself, okay? Then you're going to be yourself over here. Um, Number three research what you want to talk about right so like let's you you may be like oh my god then yeah i ain't got nothing to talk about go get you a good article on depression right see what the article say and, and if the article is long enough break it down into sections take the information just put it in your own words child and people ain't gonna know the difference okay get you a good article that you like that you can kind of identify with um and just take it and put it in your own words you know, what you got from the article. Read the article and read, and just tell people what you comprehended. You don't even have to reference the article if you don't want to. Okay? If you want to, yeah. If you don't, like, this is your takeaway that I got from this article. And you sum it up into what you want to give to people that are that is helpful. Like, be, the way to get people on board is give them, be helpful to them. Okay, like this is how I feed people into my couch to private practice program. Okay, point blank, period. Y'all see my videos. My videos are helpful to you guys. I have, I'm of a service. Like I am giving you quality information that you can use for your life. That you can use to open up your practice. Like, that's how you really and truly feed people into your practice, into what you're doing, into what you're selling or whatever. Um, so you're giving them quality information. And they're just like, if she give me, me if she's giving me that for free, I just maybe, what could she do if I pay her money? She's pull out the red carpet. Okay? <laughs> so, like, really and truly be, if you don't want to look at it as, um, or marketing or selling yourself, look at it as a way for you to help people inadvertently. Okay. That's what I do. I help you guys, whether, um, I'm, I'm just trying to help you move on. I've had so many people say, Danielle, your videos, you, you just don't know how much you are, pra um, how much you are helping me get my private practice open and things of that nature. Like you don't understand like what your videos doing. I had this one lady tell me, she was like, it was me and you last year. 
<laughs> like what? She was like, yep, it was me and you last year opening up my um, private practice because I watched your videos. And you, t you told me what to do. You told me the steps. So I did them. So like, just imagine when, if, you, if you're talking about depression or if you're talking about anxiety or whatever it is that you know you want to talk about and you're helping people, like think about it like that. Like you are real live helping people to a certain extent. And then when they need to come on over, when they feel comfortable enough, they will. And another thing, do not be worried about whether how many videos, how many um, views your video has gotten or anything like that or or if you decide to go live and nobody is on your live, like don't worry about that. Pull out that camera and get comfortable with talking to yourself. I'm a good conversation, you know? <laughs> what you think I do every time I post a video? I am literally talking to myself. Nobody is answering me on that other side. And if they do, child, Jesus, come, it must be Jesus, come get me. Um, so, <laughs> so like really and truly become comfortable with talking to yourself and with educating people. Remember that you are the expert at this. Okay. So become comfortable with that. Um, so if you got research articles and stuff like that. And number four, here's another thing that you can really talk about and become comfortable. Sometimes, you know, when we work with people, you may see a theme, a common theme that everybody is talking about for that week. Right. So like sometimes, for instance, um, because I work with a lot of uh, females, like, I don't know, sometimes everybody come in talking about the same thing. It's a common theme. That may not be the same thing verbatim, but everybody is struggling with that di that week. So whether it is, you know, um, like, let's see, what, what was my last common theme? Um, I would say it was something about God. And everybody that week, for whatever reason, was struggling with guys. And so, like, I talked about that, like, on my, um, on my Facebook page about, you know, knowing your worth. That's what it was. It was, it was like, really and truly everybody understanding their values. So, so we talked, I talked about valuing yourself the whole week, like, really and truly getting people to understand that. So what did I do? I decided to make a Facebook video about understanding your worth, understanding how valuable you are, telling people signs to identify, you know, like that's because that's what I saw the whole week. So if I know my clients is going through this, somebody else can benefit from this too. So I'm just going to take what I done said, some of the interventions that I done gave my clients, I'm going to repurpose them and put them in a Facebook video so you're not doing anything extra. Okay? Like, really and truly, just think like you're talking to a client, you're encouraging a friend when you're making these videos and stuff like that. Like, I talk to my clients like this. I talk to my friends like that. I talk to people like that that I care about like this. Like, yo, y'all got to start making these videos. Y'all have got to start being a presence on social media. Like, you have got to start marketing yourself. And if you're not doing that, what's the problem? Like, we are not being mediocre. Did you not see my video the other day? Yesterday? About we not being mediocre anymore, that we are tapping into our greatness? We doing that. All right? So, that's what we... So, uh-uh. Don't give me no excuses. Ain't no more excuses. We making videos. And, um... And last but not least, conquering yourself. Like, stop allowing fear, anxiety, whatever it may be that is holding you back. Stop allowing that to hold you back. Stop allowing that to conquer you. You conquer it. Like, sometimes we want, we want all, we want God, we need you to do this. God, I need you to do that. And God is like, nah, that's, you got to do that. You have to do that. Conquer yourself. Whether it's this right here, we're making social media videos, or whether it is something else. Time out. Some of this stuff we can do ourselves, and we must do it. Somebody got to hold us accountable, and I might as well be the one to hold you accountable because I'm holding myself accountable. I'm showing up for myself right now. And I'm showing up for you guys and pulling you guys, pulling your feet to the carpet and telling you, come on, like, what are you doing? Why haven't we done this yet? Whatever it is that you are really and truly, like I feel it's in my spirit. Like, man, like a lot of y'all be watching these videos and stuff like that. Oh, I'm getting encouraged. I'm, I'm so encouraged. I'm so inspired, Danielle. But you're not executing. You're not doing what you need to do. Like, 
I don't get on here for to, to inspire and to and you not to do anything with it. Like that's not my goal. My my goal is not just to hype you up and make you feel good. That's not my goal. Yeah, it's a part of my goal, but it's also the real thing is to execute what you're called to do, to execute the things that you need to do, to execute your practice or whatever it is that you plan on opening. That's what these videos are really and truly meant for. It's really and truly to meant for you to inspire to open up a business or open up a private practice, whether you go full-time or whether you go part-time. I don't care what you do, but you're doing what you're supposed to do. It's your purpose. That's the purpose of the videos, that you're walking into your purpose. You're, you're, you're helping the people who you need to help. We are all connected into some kind of way. So like, yo, time out, 2021, we are opening up practices. We are opening up businesses. I want to see that in the comment section. I really want to see you saying, Danielle, yo, I done did this. Danielle, yo, I done did this. I done, I done, Danielle, I done, I done submitted my paperwork to, um, you know, the insurance companies. Or Danielle, I done submitted, um... My paperwork to get a P.O. box. I don't care how little or how big it is. That's what I want you to drop in the comment section. I want you to drop in the comment section your progress. No matter how big or small it is. And trust me, I know that there's going to be a time and where you're just going to be. Where you may have a depressed moment or where you may be in a depressed episode. Where you're not doing anything for a week. If that's you, jump in the comment section and let us know so that people can love on you. Like... Yo, we got people that 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 watch these videos and 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 let me know. I can the next video I can encourage you personally. Letting you know like yo, it's okay. So really and truly use some comment sections or email me at freedomtherapycenter at gmail.com. You know, freedom email me freedomtherapycenter at gmail.com if you got something that you know you really and truly struggling with. Now, some of y'all, I won't say this, okay? I've been reading some of them comment sections, and some of y'all have been like, Danielle, could you make a video? Oh, and somebody was just like, could you make a video on all the, it, it, it was about me. I had made a video about um denials, and they was like, well, could you make videos upon all the denials that you may encounter? I was like, uh-uh. just like on oh, all the denials that I may encounter or on oh, other ones and I'm like in my mind I'm just like I was just like no because I don't know what I may encounter but what I, the video that I give you that I gave about the denials it was the um it's it's like the basis so you know I was just like no nah, this this the basis right here so like I can't make a video on all the denials because first of all I don't know and I don't get many denials <laughs> so I just thought that that was so I was like mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'm not mean I'm not meant to like shoot that person down or make y'all feel any kind of way but you know sometimes I want to say this sometimes um some of the questions for me, it's like you have to you have to go through it to under to um to actually really and truly um understand what you're asking for. And sometimes you got to make the mistakes and you got to bump your head and you or either if you don't make want to make the mistake, like you got to invest in yourself financially. Okay, and so like so, and I think for that person, I just told them that they may want to get with a certified builder. I'm not a certified builder. Okay. So, um, I wouldn't know all the encounters. Like I said, only time, only thing I know is from my own experience. I, I don't know anything else, okay? Because <laughs> I'm not a certified builder. But, as I go on the tangent, I was supposed to go down that road. But, y'all, this year in 2020, 2021, we come, we, we come in for everything that God has called us to do, what we need to do and stuff like that. And we are conquering, most importantly, we are conquering self. Like, that's going to be one of the hardest things for us to do, too, is conquer self. And I'm actually in that phase right now of conquering myself, of me being disciplined enough to be, like, at 2 o'clock in the morning making a YouTube video. 
can I just like yo and so you do the same thing too no matter what we're going through we are conquering self this year and there's no amount there's no amount of interventions um there's no amount of prayers that we can pray because now it's you just doing it you just telling yourself that is a internal battle right there between you have to make the decision telling yourself i'm gonna do this all right so i was this video is over 20 minutes shy. i wasn't supposed to be that long but nonetheless, y'all, that's all I got for y'all today. Y'all make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Y'all jump in that comment section below and let me know what y'all think and stuff like that about today's video. But before I hop up off of here, you know I'm going to go in here. I'm going to give y'all a, I'm give y'all a prayer today, okay? I'm going to give you another prayer for this, um, this topic because I know that it's a lot and it's scary for a lot of people. And I want y'all to know that it's sometimes it's scary for me too. It has been scary for me too. It took me a while to really and truly just start making videos and stuff like that. And sometimes I still get scared or whatever. But I, I don't allow that to stop me. So we're going to pray. Father God, thank you God for allowing us to come once more and again before your throne. And thank you God for just allowing us to be able to call you. Thank you God for allowing us to be in our right mind to worship you. Mm, I thank you God. Yes, God, for being able to worship you, me having the right mind, for me knowing who you are, and me understanding that you are my father and that you will um that you love your children, Father God. So God, I thank you right now, God. I thank you for everybody that will watch this video, Father God. I actually lift them up unto you, Father God, no matter what they are going through, no matter God, I bind fear in the name of Jesus, God. I lift up their businesses up unto you, Father God. I pray that a fresh new anointing rest rule and abide within them. Father God, let your presence be known within them, Father God. Let your presence be known within their businesses, Father God. Lord God, I thank you, God, for everybody that watched this video, Father God. And I also not only just lift them up, but I also lift their clients up unto, up unto you too, Father God. So, Lord God, I thank you, God, for who you are. And God, I come to you right now, God, for my brothers and my sisters that are watching this video, Father God. And I ask that you give them the spirit of um, being able to overcome themselves, Father God. For for them to be able to overcome any type of fears, Father God, that they may have, Father God, I pray that they know that they are more than conqueror, God, that they can do this, that you have already equipped them for this, God, that you have made them for this, Father God. Lord God, let your spirit rest in them, Father God. Holy Spirit, give them guidance, give them wisdom, Father God. Lord God, I thank you, God, for all that you are doing for them. I thank you, God, for what you're going to do. I thank you that you're going to not, you're going to give them the spirit of courage right now in the name of Jesus that they're going to be able to walk away from this video feeling encouraged they're going to pick up their camera and they're going to introduce themselves to their own audience Father God and they're just going to go from there so Father I thank you right now God I thank you God for every business that is going to come forth in 2021 Father God I thank you God that we're just going to be able to help build the kingdom that the kingdom is getting stronger from all of these businesses Father God that we are building Father God and I thank you right now I thank you God for kingdom businesses Father God I thank you God and I ask that you just continue to watch over us and be with us so guys I thank y'all so much and before I hop up off of here if you have watched this video to this long I want to ask you guys to pray for my mom as well. Um, we are having surgery Thursday morning. She's having certain knee surgery. And um, truth be told, I'm a little nervous. That's another reason why I'm up. Um, because I'm a little nervous about the whole surgery. I need to journal. Um, so I got my little... After I get off with you guys, I'm going to journal about, you know, how I'm feeling and stuff like that and pray to God. So, if y'all can, if you know a word of prayer, lift up. Her name is Dorothy and she's having knee surgery. Um, we we kind of had the conversation today about, um, God forbid, that she doesn't make it um, through this surgery. And that in itself is a conversation that you, no child wants to have with their parents. But the conversation is needed. You have to have the conversation. So, um, y'all just keep us in your prayers. And I thank y'all so much. And I will see y'all again on... If I don't see y'all on Friday, it's because, of course, my mom had surgery on Thursday, okay? But I am going to try my best to put out a video on Friday because, again, I still need to be disciplined enough and create content. Because, again, the goal of this channel this year, one of our goals 
is to get monetized this year. All right. So nonetheless, love you guys. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.